Chikami everybody, this is Miyaku. I am back for part 40 of Animal Crossing New Horizons Let's Play. I can't believe that I've already made it to 40 episodes. That's what happens when work suddenly goes down the toilet like it has. Hopefully it recovers soon. I hope everything is going well with you guys. I have 20... Well, I checked yesterday at night. 25 subscribers, so thank you everybody for... Oh, I gotta mute my phone. I'm echoing here. There we go. Yeah, 25. So thank you everybody who's subscribed, who's liked, who's commented. It really helps. Um, I appreciate it. It'll help us make this place better and greater and make it what we all think it can be. Um, I appreciate it. If you like what we're doing and you want to see more, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell so that you'll be notified when I go live and we'll all have fun together. Right now on tonight's show, it's 7.33 on Thursday, April 9th. Now for today's announcements. We have a new friend on our island. Let's give a tonight, a big tonight show welcome to Diana. Welcome. Congrats, Diana. I'm sure you'll enjoy island life here. And with that, I'll get back to work supporting you and your enjoyment of our island. I've got my live chat open tonight, so I'm not going to miss it if somebody decides to pop in and say hello. Oh, I forgot I have my creepy skeleton mask on. I can make that leaf mask. Should I make the leaf mask? This is Timmy from Nook's Cranny. We've sent a payment to your bank account for 27,000 bells. Thanks for using the service. So first things first, let's check. I've got plenty of room for this. My little boy was playing earlier and, oh, for mom. My dear Jimmy, cherry blossom petals dance upon the wind like some kind of bizarre battalion of breeze ballerinas. A smile graces my face as I watch the petals fall. All is well until, achoo. What a nice poem, mom. Um, my little boy was playing earlier. And he said that turnips are 148, so I'm going to make bank tonight. Here's some nook miles because I helped a resident move in. I don't want to favorite that. I want to throw it away. And nook shopping, rocking KK. All right. Let's go clean out my inventory. One huge quality of life improvement that I would love to see would be, oh, actually, I have flowers. Let's plant the flowers before I do this. One huge quality of life improvement I would like to see is the ability to dump my whole pocket into my inventory without doing it one at a time. That would be quite nice. Oh, that's just a tiger beetle. Let's plant the flowers right here in front of Tammy's place. Oh, I got my cool rockin' ska song on there. Oh, what did mom give me? Mom's tissue box. Let's put Rock and KK on just to see what it sounds like. How about that? Soulful. Oh, yeah, it's Johnny Be Good. Oh, I gotta watch Back to the Future now. Okay, okay. Let's get my turnips and go sell my turnips without further delay. I do not want to miss out on my chance to make money. Lots of money. I should put Rock and Ska on my... No, KK Ska onto my, my own little record player. Do, 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 do. I'm so glad that I've got all of these turnips here. I didn't want the washing machine, or the light, or those, ah, or my rug. Come on, I want the turnips. <laughs> okay. Well, that should be enough to make a trip. I'll make another trip. But I don't really like that light anyways. Let's just... Or the washing machine. I don't really need the washing machine. We'll just put these in storage. I'll find something better eventually. How many more have I got? Six? I need nine. Nine spaces? 
Oh, I can totally get everything. Let's get everything into storage. This is going to be a huge payday, guys. And gals. I seem to get more people commenting when I play really late at night time. Not like super late at night time, but still, later than this. Um, I don't really need my ladder right now, so I'll put that in storage. Because I'll be back before I need to go anywhere. Alright, perfect. Let's go sell. A full room full of turnips. Well, it was an interesting day today. I had, I had zero patience to see, sadly. Normally I have a few, but it was zero. This whole quarantine business has really just put my business right down the drain. It's kind of sad because I was doing pretty well building up my practice here. And now it's all gone. Hopefully it comes back. I'm a little bit nervous about it. I'm not sure what's going to happen. Hope you guys are all safe and secure economically, socially, medically. Look at that cute picnic basket over there. Welcome, Jimmy. I like how the, the plates are tied up there with a little belt. Welcome, Jimmy. Welcome. What do you need today? I want to see turnip prices. 148 bells per turnip. I got to take that price. Let's sell. Okay, watch this. Here we go. This is going to be a huge payday. It's going to be over 300,000. It's going to be closer to 450,000. It should be. I am taking these little shorts pants boys for all they're worth. Look at all the fine things you brought in today. Let me just run the numbers. Yeah, you crunch those numbers. They're going to be huge. 446,000 bells. That's perfect. Now watch tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm probably going to get a price of like 800, something ridiculous, just because I sold all my bales. I do want this wall-mounted candle. 800 bells, I'll buy it, it's nice. And um, what's in here? Let's see. Orange windflowers, red hyacinth, white hyacinth, yellow mums. I got all those. Navy wrapping paper. Wildest Dreams DIY, I got those. Dirt clawed wall, oh, that sounds cool. Pink heart pattern, chic tea room wall. Black iron parquet flooring. Blue camo flooring, it sounds busy but cool. Blue paint flooring, monochromatic dot flooring. Let's get this black iron parquet, that looks like it's interesting. It's the most expensive, so it must be the best, right? Nothing but the best for me. And chic tea room wall. Let's check that out, too. And, um, I think that'll be good for now. I want to support their store, make it grow a little bit. Oh, and the Able Sisters. They should still be open for, like, 20 more minutes. I gotta run over there. Now that my pockets are filled with cash. Get there before anything changes. You guys are still open, right? Oh, perfect. Look at that suit. Oh, it's nice and slick. Oh, it's a jumpsuit. I thought it was like a three-piece suit. Never mind. If it's a jumpsuit, well, that might be even better. Hey there, welcome to Able Sisters, where we sell fashions made lovingly by Claw. Cowboy suit's still there. What are these? Rubber toe high tops? Those sound cool, they're like Converse. I want to see what colors you have. I've learned. You sell them in colors if you go in the dressing room. Sorry, I kind of have to focus on this so I don't wreck it. Well, focus on me for a second so you don't wreck us. No talking, only sewing. Oh, come on. 
Oh, whoops, I'm happy to help you with whatever you need. Just step away from the seamstress. Hey, Mabes, could you help this customer, please? Okay, okay, I get it. You don't want to see me. I want to... L I want to look at the bottom row. I want to display my work here. I want to give you my killers, so people can buy the killers, the best band logo. Um, what should we do with the design? I'll, I guess I'll take it with me. Where would I want to save it? This is interesting. I'll save it right there. Delete it. Okay, good. Oh, look at that sweet killer's shirt. And, um... I gotta sell Mr. Saturn. Actually, let's sell it over the top of that purple hat. Top row, please. Mystery knit cap. I want to display my work here. I want to display my Mr. Saturn. What should we do with the design? I will take it with me, I guess. I will save it into this. I don't know why I'm keeping it. There we go. Look at that beautiful Mr. Saturn shirt. It's all yours if you want it. And let's check out these rubber high tops. Hey, I got somebody else watching. Thanks for stopping by. Okay, where did the rubber high tops go? Shoes? Oh, those are socks. <laughs> and the cowboy boots. Hey, those are cool looking sneakers. There's the rubber high tops. Yeah, they do look like Converse. Or Vans, I guess. Anyways, let's get back to business. Yeah, nothing really caught my eye today, sorry. It looks like you have a pretty nice shop. I don't know that I need to buy to support. Maybe they grow more stuff if you do that. I'm not sure. All right, now I'm ready to do my normal routine here. Digging up stuff. Oh, eggs again. These eggs, they're going to be the death of me. I also wish I could access my storage from where I'm at right now. That would be nice. Any weird bugs on these? There was one yesterday that I missed. It was probably just a regular beetle. I'm looking for those rusted pieces. Sometimes you get a rusted piece from those little clam spots, but it seems exceptionally rare. That's uh, Mighty Milo's house. We fixed that one up, so he's got a house now. I've got a little fossil to give to Blathers. We'll do that real quick. You can assess my fossil. That's how you can be of service, Blathers. He gets so excited for fossils. I love it. Blathers is like my favorite. Let me see here. Hmm. Indeed. Hoo-hoo! Of course, it can be but one thing. A T-Rex skull. I've already got plenty of those, I'm pretty sure. Yep, we already have one of those. I guess I'll sell that one. No, that's all I needed. I'm good for now, Blathers. I got no bugs for you. Gotta stop in and check on and check in on Isabel and Mr. Nook. See what's going on with him. I know my boys have been digging up a lot of stuff today, so if there aren't very many fossils left, it's probably because they've got them all in their pockets. I should oh what's that green? Is it just a go board? What's a go board? Like the game? The game go? Let's redeem some Nook Miles. Get a Nook Miles ticket. Oh, Holiday Kid says hi. 
Hey, Holiday Kid, what's up? Thanks for, thanks for stopping in. If you got any questions for me, let me know. If you're just here to chill and relax, that's fine too. That's sort of what I'm here for. I think I have all those things. So let's just send my my music over to my buddy Zabadar. Well, this is exciting to have somebody watching and me being there when being available when they're there. This is a first for me. Which one should I send here? Balloons? I kind of like this graffiti one. I think that's my favorite. So what's up, Holiday Kid? Have you got this game? You just interested in it? Oh, a doctor's mask? I should get that. That'll match my actual profession. And because of coronavirus, everyone's supposed to be wearing a mask outside right now. So I will support the government regulations right now. Oh, I didn't buy the music for myself. Aloha KK. Maybe that's what I should put on inside my house. An ABD. I guess I'll pay off my loan now that I've got this newfound wealth, right? Pay from pockets. The full, full amount. All right. That's an exciting day. That was a huge loan. I love the eyebrows on this skull mask, by the way. I don't know what it is about them, but that, they tickle my fancy. Oh, none of those. Trash tools. Rowdy punk, huh? Cornering the stock market. Status-minded spectator. Avaricious money bags. I've been called worse. Upstart trader. All right. So if you make a million bells, you get another thing. Wow, that's a big one. Popular pen pal. Keep sending letters. All right. I'm going to keep sending some letters. Oh, it looks like Holiday Kid left. I'm back on my own again. All right, let's expand my house again. How about that? Well, hello there, Jimmy. Thanks once again for the diligent repayment of your home loan. Yes, yes. I must ask, were you prompt payments motivated by a desire for expansion? Because if so, I have good news. I would be more than happy to extend your f you further credit for construction. Do please come see me if you'd like to discuss the details more, hmm? Well, I'm here. Discuss with me. This is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you, hmm? Let's talk about my home. I want to expand. I must have been boring. Holiday Kid popped in and left. I was too boring. 548,000 bells? I'm sort of interested. I'm so happy for you, I'm going to make sure construction begins right away. It occurs to me, this might be a good time to consider a new color for your roof. There are eight color options. Please select a roof color. What is a good, a good summer springtime color? Aqua? Should be finished by tomorrow. You're pretty quick, huh? I should talk about infrastructure, too. I haven't done any of those, but I kind of would like to build a bridge. And a ramp. I kind of want to... Uh, oh, I should sell some more land, I guess. That's okay. I'm ready to pay. Yep, I'm ready to pr prep lots of plots of land to get lots of neighbors in here. I'll just hand over the housing kit. Use it to claim a plot for a new house, Jimmy. Use the kit when you find a good location. Off you go now. Is there anything else I can help you with? Um, oh, not what should I do? Oh, 
Okay, let's figure out um, some more infrastructure. Let's sell some more land. How much can I sell? Oh. You can only have one at a time. Okay. Because he finds the bookkeeping tedious. <laughs> let's build a bridge. I want to... Layout changes? Build... I don't know what the layout changes imp implies there. I want to build a bridge. A log bridge, that's cheap. Suspension bridge is not too much more. Stone bridge looks nice. Oh, brick bridge. An iron bridge. A Ren Zen bridge? And a regular Zen bridge. What do I like the most? That, that one looks really nice. The wooden bridge... I think... I think I want to go for the suspension bridge. Yeah, I want to proceed with that one. Use the bridge marker kit I've placed in your pockets to set aside some land for our bridge project. Use your kit near a river and you'll be able to imagine how a bridge will look. And Isabel, let's get my town rating again, see what's going on there. Let's talk Island Eve House. I am curious about the current image of Tonight Show. Right now, Tonight Show has a two-star rating. Some positive buzz floating around. Folks are starting to take notice. Allow me to read an excerpt from the feedback that I gathered. It's like when a snow person is built just right. Sure, it's a good thing to be well-made and to feel the love, but I don't know that a snow person would get the proper attention here. That's my take. Hmm. What does that mean? It lacks appealing scenery. Decorate the entire island head to toe. Oh, man. Okay. So they want decorations. Nook Miles decorations specifically? Is that what I'm understanding here? I feel like that was the gist of her hint. Was buy the Nook Miles stuff and decorate your island with that. And that will increase your island appeal. So that will be my goal eventually. Because I got to get KK here somehow. Oh, there you are, Jacob. I haven't seen you for a while. Where were you hiding out yesterday? I guess I should just sell those DIY recipes, huh? They're probably not worth much, but they're worth more than just sitting on the ground. Hello, Jacob. You out getting some wood for a fire? Do you want this, Jacob? I, f I have something perfect for you. It is a... Hmm, what is perfect for him? A go board. You want a go board? You seem like you might like games. Wait a second, is this a go board? Thanks, I love this kind of stuff. But you knew that, didn't you? Once I've cleaned up my house, I'll set this out. I can't wait to hear what all my bug friends think about it. Oh, he likes bugs. I should give him bugs, I guess. Oh, sure, you can give me some bells. I'm not really hurting for bells now. Oh no, did I just hit him with a shovel? I think I did. I'm sorry, Jacob. Bunny day is almost here. That means eggs are going to be in all kinds of weird places. Yeah, tell me about it. You love bunny day? I like it too, but I'm tired of the eggs, to be honest. How are you doing, Ra-Ra? I got something for you too. I'm giving you a thing. I'm giving you a wall-mounted candle. It's lovely. You'll love it. It's beautiful. It's not a fire hazard at all. I am sure that you can have this. You love this color? Oh, perfect. You're going to show this off in your house? Awesome. As soon as you figure out where to put it. You put it on the wall. That's all. It's super great to see you. What do you need? Just want to talk. The whole line is getting ready for buddy day. Isn't it the best? Want to know why I love it so much? It's because the weirdest stuff happens. 
Like if you stand next to a coconut tree and give it a smack, a load of wood eggs fall out. Candy eggs on trees, that's bunny day for you. Ra ra. Pears here to sell. I'm just gonna leave the apples. I don't really need the apples. I have a buddy who likes to collect them. He might pop on over to my island sooner or later and just take some apples. Ooh, I hear a package flying somewhere. Oh! Ragdad says, play Overwatch. Overwatch is a pretty cool game. I've never actually played it, but I've seen it, and it looks really fun. I like games like that a lot. But I don't know that I will play it. I just don't have that much time to play games. And I like this one. Is that what you're into, Ragdad, I take it? You love Overwatch? Let's see, there was something to dig somewhere. It must have been closer to my house. Dad, I don't think he's even watching anymore. He just popped in and said, play Overwatch. That's not where I wanted you to go. I wanted you to go right there. Actually, that one's probably blue. I could put it right there. There we go. KK Rockin' is pretty good. stop in and say hello to Sly. He's home. So the game that I play that's like Overwatch, well, it's it's sort of similar. My little boy and I play Plants vs. Zombies. He is totally hooked on it. And it's, I gotta admit, it's really fun. I think I'd prefer some... Oh, jungle flooring, cool. I personally prefer Splatoon, I think, over all of the other shooters. So Splatoon's my mine of choice. Yeah, teach me how to build this jungle flooring. See it, Sly. When they're building stuff and you talk to them, they give you a DIY recipe.
jungle flooring. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Oh, I got some Nook Miles to claim, too. Well, I think that does it for my little space on the island. So I'll put some stuff into my storage and then I'll head back out. I dropped my ladder. I gotta pick my ladder back up for sure. Black iron parquet. What does that look like? Oh, that's really fancy. It's a little fancy for my house. I'll keep it though. Chic tea room wall. Any items overlapping with the window were sent to storage. Wow, my house looks real fancy now. I'll just leave it, I guess. I don't know exactly what was in storage. Bridge kit and a housing kit, okay. Mom's tissues, what do these look like? Just tissues, okay. I'll keep them in my pocket in case somebody wants them when I meet them. It's good to keep a little, a few little things on my, on my person that people might like. There's my bandages. There's my ladder. Oh, my hat, my mesh cap. That came off my wall, that's okay. There's my sweet stellar jumpsuit. Oh, it's so beautiful. My creepy skull radio. All right, well, I guess that's it. Let's um, put some music on in here. It's kind of quiet in here. Let's do... What did I just learn? KK Ska. There was something else I thought I just learned or picked up. Yeah, we'll do KK Ska for now. I do like Ska music. I can't lie. It, it's some of my preferred music, actually. Or at least it was back when I was in high school. I still like it. Let me shake these down. I haven't seen Tammy around. I wonder where Tammy's at. I talked a little bit about my patient the other day who has pemphigus and I'm trying to figure out what type he has. I think I've come down and decided that he has pemphigus herpetiformis. Um, it, it may actually be IgG slash IgA pemphigus, but I'm definitely going to bring him to Grand Rounds and see what the other dermatologists in the department think about him and the preferred treatment. Because I'm thinking that rituximab is the best for him, but it's not a medicine that's without risk. So I don't want to commit him to that. Hey, hey, I got another viewer. Thanks for stopping by. If you have suggestions or feedback or anything, let me know. Oh, 
Oh, hold on. I don't want this to be my favorite right here. Oh, no, no, no. Unfavorite it. What did I have there anyways? I don't remember what I had there. Hmm. It escapes me. That's okay. And I lost my other viewer. Oh, it's tough. It's tough getting up past that one. <laughs> the hump of one. Good evening to you. Isn't it a nice night out, Feathers? And this is yours. I have some tissue boxes for you. She's wearing the sweater that somebody gave her. Where did they go? Mom's tissue box. There you go. What? You're really giving me Mom's tissue box? She seemed like she loved it. Thank you so much. I've been hoping for something like this. I've been looking at things like this to use as accents. Her house is going to be filled with junk that I gave her. Jaden Reddy says, what's my dodo code? I, I don't know what my dodo code is. A dodo code, I'm assuming I get it from the dodo flight people. And you use it to visit my island, I presume? Oh, there's one of those moths. It's the bug net. That's what I'm missing. I gotta make a bug net. So I take it you want my dodo code for visiting my island? To sell turnips or something? If that's what you want it for, that sounds good to me. I just need a little bit more. I keep trying to get sticks and I keep getting stuff that's more valuable. Here we go. Okay, I will go get my dodo code right after I catch this moth. Sound okay? Let's craft. Your island is probably a lot more impressive than mine, Jaden. I sort of do this when I have time, which is a lot more frequent than it used to ever be, but it's not as much as some of those things. I see some people's creations out there and they're out of control. Oh, I snuck up. Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> Just forget you saw that. Okay, let's go find my dodo code. Pears and cherries. I think, I think I've got some pears around. I, I might have actually uprooted all my cherries. I wonder if I can dig up a cherry tree and just leave it there for you. Um, visitors, I think, right? Online play. Oh, here we go. Dodo code. I haven't done this before, so that's new for me. Oh, yep, he said that. A five-character code. You just give that code to anybody you want to invite, and they'll enter it when they come visit. But you should know that the code is only good for this visit. Next time, they'll have a different code. Um, the more the merrier? Is that what I do? With this method, you might wind up having people you don't know visit your island. You good with that? Um... Sure. Opening the gate now. Your dodo code is 9P196. Here we go. I'll put it down here. Um, 9P196. Okay. The gate's open so visitors might show up any time. There might even be folks you don't know. It's a big ocean full of islands out there after all. If you're playing with a pal and you want to keep out of the rabble, let me know and I'll close the gate. Don't do anything I wouldn't... I wouldn't dodo? Is that what he said? I missed. I wasn't reading. Well, I guess you're welcome to come over. I don't know exactly what you can and can't do when you're visiting somebody with a dodo code, so I will learn... I, I will learn that right now, I guess. Hopefully it's not a mistake. 
Okay, I've got some apples. I know I have a lot of these trees are little cherry sprouts. But I was I was kind of a, a genius and I dug them up to replant them thinking that that was how I would get some golden or perfect cherries and they haven't regrown yet. I think one of these trees right here is also a cherry tree. Who's this guy? I haven't seen this little guy before. He's like a little beaver. What's up, Fishionista? CJ here, coming at you live from uh, right in front of you, Nyuk. I'm touring the island looking for fresh faces and fresher fish to show off on my live stream. <laughs> Fishing is reeling in all kinds of streaming numbers right now. Heard of esports? Well, this is C Sports. Anyway, I need new fish if I want to keep my followers following. That's where you come in. If you got fish to sell, then I want to buy. Simple as that. I'll pay premium. If you cash out, I get new selfies for my blog. Even my viewers get to hear me fish, me talk fish. Everyone wins. Challenge sea sorts file. Right now, win and I'll make it ring and talk you up on my stream. Plus, my partner's into making slick collectibles if you want one. He's so talented. Nyuk, nyuk. Okay. Um, not now, because I said to end the conversation. He'll be here till 5 a.m. tomorrow. Okay. Buried hole. All right. Well, here comes Jaden. Jaden Reddy is visiting the Tonight Show. <laughs> Welcome. From Astoria. Ah. Maybe you're a fan of Zach Scott. Is that where you got the name from, or you just like Astoria? I'm not implying anything. I just his island was named Astoria. I think, right? Or maybe it still is. I haven't seen his new series yet. <laughs> yeah, that's that's sort of what got me into Animal Crossing, actually, was watching Zack Scott. My brother always tried to get me into it. I mean, we played the GameCube one way, way long ago, but I was too little and it just wasn't my thing. And then... As I started doing like chores and stuff around the house, I would put Zack Scott's Animal Crossing thing on and watch it just to have noise on in the background. And I decided I was gonna play my own. Oh, he's got a doctor mask on too. Perfect, perfect. We're isolating. This is perfect for coronavirus. I don't have mine on. Where did mine go? Jaden's first one he's played was Wild World, he says. I never played that one. I didn't have I didn't have money to buy the game at the time that was around. That's when my brother really got into it too. Yeah, I can't actually just give up the trees. So I'm not sure how I'm going to get cherries to him. I got pears I can drop. Well, someone else is on their way. Who else is coming in? I got another viewer. It's a mystery. It's a secret to everybody. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome whoever you are. Rain from Russia. Ooh. So mysterious. Kamchatka? Or Western Russia? Or um, Siberia? Let's see, where else do I know in Russia? Irkutsk? Actually, that's only from Risk. I know that from Risk. That might not even be a place in Russia anymore. <laughs> Let's see, I know, I know a few Russian words. My sister-in-law went to Russia as a missionary, and she taught me some things like... Um, Dobre dien? I think is... I think that's... Good night? Dobre dien? And cocktail is good day? Rain is a festive sun. Oh, he's all decked out in his Easter stuff. Good for you, Rain. The more the merrier, for now at least, right? Okay, here's some pears for you. Hold on. 
There you go. Oh, I can drop these little things too. I don't actually need these. I don't know if you need them, but whoever needs these can have them. There you go. And... All right. Well, sorry I dug up all my cherries. That was kind of a mistake on my part. I wasn't thinking when I did that. I'm just gonna go check on some islanders here. I probably won't be able to put my bridge pieces down and my new my new housing plot down while I have visitors. Because it has historically not let me do stuff like that. Decorate. Don't mind the mess on my wooden table. I don't see a mess there. You have like a, a pot and a very, very nice looking tablecloth. You spilled something on it. I don't see anything. Oh, but you put out the cordless phone and the tissues. Look at that. And the kitty litter box. I don't really need anything. I was just saying hi. She's quick. I think Celia likes me. She put out those tissues right away. Now I got five viewers. All right. We're way up here now. I'm cruising along. <laughs> Hope you enjoy my island. Turns out great DIY ideas can hit at really inconvenient times, like just as I'm falling asleep. And then I thought, where's the fun in keeping this recipe to myself? You got this. I believe in you. An iron garden bench. All right. Oh, don't forget, if you have, um, if you have turnips to sell, my turnips are selling for 148 right now, which isn't like amazing, but it's way better than 50. 50 is what I've been getting all week. Oh, thanks. Samantha Gaming Channel says my island is nice. Thank you. Kind words. It's not much, but it's home. Really, I think most people's islands are nice. This game makes it really hard to make it so your island is not nice. I saw I saw Jaden running around. Hopefully he's having fun here on here on the Tonight Show. Samantha still plays New Leaf. Oh, I never did play New Leaf. I, I watched Zach Scott do it, and that's what really got me hungry for Animal Crossing. It looks really pretty. I, lo I love the art style of New Leaf. And I actually really like the 3D effect of the 3DS. So I was kind of sad that they kind of stopped making 3D games for it. And you really can't even buy a 3DS in the store anymore. I was looking for one because mine is getting beat up and you can't really buy a new one. Oh, Jaden says he likes my island too. Thanks. These eggs, man, there are so many eggs. Do you guys love the Easter eggs, or are you tired of the Easter eggs? Samantha likes all Animal Crossing games. They're kind of hard not to like, right? They sort of make them so that they should appeal to almost everybody. Even that little old... Oh, there's Cherry over there. She's so sneaky. Even that little old grandma who played, who played New Leaf for like thousands of hours. I saw that on YouTube. And somebody gave her a, a copy of this new game, plus the cool switch for it. I'm having trouble getting this fish set up just right. That... Oh, and he turns around. Come on, fish. I want to catch you and sell you to CJ. <laughs> this fish is really snubbing me right now. There we go. That's perfect. Wow. 
Samantha says she likes those eggs on Bunny Day. Do they do something different on Bunny Day? I've never been through a Bunny Day myself. I don't know what happens. It's going to be a mystery to me. Unless you can give me some insider information on what happens on Bunny Day. Oh, I got somebody else coming. Maybe? I'm lucky that my town hall is directly in front of my airport, says Jaden. Um, did I choose that? I don't know if I chose that or not. Was it just the way your island is set up? Like, you don't get a pick? Lewis, from he's arriving from Game Boy. All right, Lewis, welcome. I didn't know you were watching. I hope you find something on the island that you enjoy. Remember, turnip prices are up right now. 148 So you can make a pretty penny on it. This little loading screen is so cute, I can't even be mad about it. <laughs> I was kind of sad that my airport color was... It's like this rusty orange-red color. I was hoping for like a blue one or a yellow one. It's okay. But I think I've seen other people with different airport colors. I wonder if they'll let you change it eventually. It, it should be a customization option when you talk to Nook. Oh man, look at his crown and his monocle. Lewis is a high roller. And that purple coat. I have I have a fancy coat. I should put my fancy coat on so that we can be friends. Now where did my fish go? Oh, it disappeared. I should put my fishing rod away because I missed my I missed my shooting stars the other night. If any of you guys that are visiting need anything, let me know. There there might be some stuff that I have that I can give you. Um, like I said, I have cherries, but I accidentally... Well, I didn't accidentally. I purposely dug them all up and replanted them, because I thought I was being smart. And they haven't started producing cherries again yet, so that was my bad. It was one of my less brilliant moments. I thought that's how I'd get perfect fruit. If you know the way to get perfect fruit, let me know. Ooh, that was a quick bite. Cherry's walking around outside. Let's talk to Cherry. Hi, how's my bestie? Tra la la. What's the latest? I'm practicing posing. It's an important life skill. You never know when you might need to pose. Are you going to teach me how to pose? Can you teach me? Are the folks on the island today here to see you, Jimmy? I have to go say hi before they go home. Do you think my outfit is, I don't know, weird today? I mean, I just want to make... Oh, she's blushing for you guys. An extra fashionable for our company. Rainya has peaches on their island. Oh, I have some peaches too. And... I think I have... Unless my little boys dug them up. Which I wouldn't put past them because they periodically dig up stuff. And don't tell me that they've done it. Like these trees, they deforested this little plateau on my island for me. <laughs> oh, I'm getting a little lag there. That's what happens. I wonder why it's lagging. And the lag is gone. Oh, but somebody's already hit this rock. Maybe one of my visitors. I don't know. I know I have I know I have a few peach trees. I'm not sure which ones they are anymore. Until they produce peaches again, I won't know. Now these are red ones. I should Oh and, and white ones. I need to dig these up so I can put them next to my other. Someone's leaving. We'll see you later. I don't know who's leaving yet, but thanks for visiting. Thanks for stopping by the channel. Oh, it's Jaden. We'll see you later, Jaden. Oh, hey, it's a cool fanny pack or a, a one-shoulder backpack on his back. So 
So are you guys doing well with all this school and work delay? You having trouble with it? Oh, my pockets are full. Yeah, let's swap it. Can I just put this clam down? Oh, I can. You can release a clam anywhere, I guess. Let's see what Shep... Hey, Shep, your house is cool. Look at this shower he's got. I can't do anything with it. He has a stove, too. I like to turn everybody's stove on. Is that bad? Oh, he has a fridge? You got nothing in your fridge, Shep. That's, that's smart. He has a little table behind his bed so he can put a clock up there. And that cool deer head on the wall. Shep, you got a cool house, pal. You'll be my fabulous host? Oh, thanks. Just look at the talent we've assembled here. Shep and Jimmy in one room. I wonder who will play us in the inevitable film adaptation. He, he is an aspiring movie star. Yo, you want to chat? I don't blame you. He thinks he's pretty cool, doesn't he? I haven't flown anywhere. You might find something hidden in the rocks. Yeah, they're around my house, too. Who needs that many eggs? The real question is, who cares? <laughs> These are exclusive limited time eggs, which means I have to have as many as possible. He knows how my brain works. Shep is inside my brain. Oh man, he's so... Shep is way cooler than me. Look at his awesome vinyl record player. Okay, I like your house, Shep. I am envious. Oh, I'm getting some serious lag. Let's swap that. Here we go. And let's give Shep a neighbor up here. Oh, I didn't mean to sit down. I was going to give him a neighbor. Oh, yep, I can't do it when I have company. I thought it would say that. I guess I was right. Oh, I have a full... I really have full pockets. I need to go empty out my pockets. go. I don't need that one. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying my island, whatever it is that you're up to. <laughs> Hopefully you can't cause too much mischief without me being around. Oh, I hear somebody. I hear some little tools changing. There's the person. I, I don't know, who, um, which one are you? Are you... Is there a way to tell who's here? I don't know if I can tell. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, he says hi. That's Lewis. Okay, so that's how I can tell. And... Lewis... He's texting something, too. Lewis wants... Isn't it so hard to text? It's so frustrating to text through this little phone, isn't it? I love how the phones cast a little bit of light on the people's faces. It's a small detail, but I think it's cool. He's, 
got to be almost can get me can get you what I'm on the edge of my seat here Lewis what what do you want <laughs> Something, something, he's thinking. Nani. Can I get you Nani? I don't know what you mean by Nani. Can you explain a little further? Oh, these eggs. What do you mean by Nani? Oh, there's Tammy. Hey, Tammy. Hey there, Night Flyer. How goes, you heard? Uh, this is for you, Tammy. What is it, you heard? It is a... Hmm. I don't really have any cool stuff to give. Right? A wall-mounted candle. You want one of these? Didn't I already give that to somebody? Seriously, Backbeat, you knew exactly what to get me. Oh, yeah, she named me Backbeat. I'm going to need to clean up a little before I show this off. It'll look so, so, so rad, you heard. Oh, my shovel. I probably don't have enough stuff to build a shovel right now, do I? I don't. I have to buy a shovel. Okay, can you help me? I gotta. I gotta sell some stuff here, Timmy. I am offering uh, an apple, I guess, and a clam, and. Uh, really uh, most of the stuff I want to keep I guess the salmon I don't need six thousand bells sold oh hello my little friend is back hello hello rain thanks for stopping by my island it's a pleasure to have you here Hope you're enjoying yourself. I just need a shovel, my good man. One shovel. One flimsy shovel. Nope, that's all I needed. I actually was going to do my flower hybridizing right here, I forgot. Pink and red and then purple. Oh wow, that was scary. Was that one of those party poppers? <laughs> it startled me. And some white flowers. All these are pretty good. Thanks for watering my flowers, pal. I don't exactly know what I'm doing with these. I'm just sort of pretending. have some yellow mums over here I should bring over. Oh, I missed. Oops, I didn't mean to pick those. I just wanted to kick the holes in, that's all. What a polite island guest. He's watering my flowers for me. Let's see, I need to have yellow touching red, I guess. And I don't have yellow touching pink or blue. Let's have yellow touch blue for now. I can get another yellow one, I think. Yeah, let's sell these few little flowers I got right here. 
I don't think Blathers will accept donations while I am here, or while I've got visitors here. So I'll just keep my fossils for later. Host the most. Oh, cool. You get Nook Miles just for having people visit your island. I need four more people, I guess, to get the maximum on that one. And I think... I think I've almost explored everything on my island for now. No, it's not closed. I gotta go do that later. I gotta feed the cats, too. I haven't fed my kitties yet tonight. They come and they meow at my window if I haven't done it. Oh, let's get these yellow mums. I'm gonna make my mums all mingle. I'll mingle my mums. I'll mingle my mums the mostest. Oh, that's already been done. Oh, this is, this is Diana's house down here. I haven't stopped in to see Diana yet, have I? I don't know if you're, when you're visiting other people's islands, can you do their rocks and stuff to like their money rocks? probably should check that to make sure I don't have miscreants here taking my money rocks from me. But that's okay. I made a fortune in the stock market today, so I can spare whatever money rock there is. Ooh, first bite. What is this one? Just a bass. Oh. I've heard... I, I don't know if it's real or not, but I heard that you can catch... Snapping turtles. I have not seen a snapping turtle yet. I think they're in the rivers during the season that we're in right now. So that's something that I've got to keep my eyes out for. That's why if you see me fishing in the rivers more than it seems like I normally do, it's because I'm looking for a snapping turtle. See there. It looks like he's gonna say something to me. He's thinking. Oh, you caught a snapping turtle. Wait, who said that? That was Rain. How did you catch a snapping turtle, Rain? Is it just in the river? Is there anything special you have to do for it? Oh, wait. Why am I giving my fish away? I forgot that he will buy these. Yeah, Rain says, in the river. I'll tell you what fish to catch and you get fishing, but the hook is that it switches up each time. That's the dealio. Are you ready for some sea sport action? Three big time fish in a row. A puffer fishing... S like, puffer fish. Okay. Serious bells. Let's do this. Okay. Three big time fish in a row, all about the size of a puffer fish. Soft shelled turtles or snapping turtles also count. They're pretty big too. Don't go catch an other sized fish or my subscribers will get mad and there goes your streak. Huh. I gotta keep folks happy or my views drop. Now go catch something, yuck. Interesting. 
Aren't there collectibles? I knew that it hooked you. Yeah, put in an order for a collectible. I'll get you a super realistic model of your favorite fish. My partner is a total artist, and I can guarantee these models will make your neighbors jealous. He's all about models of bugs and stuff, but he's got a fish to work from. His work is amazing. Three of the same kind of fish, and I'll get it going for you. All for the low, low price of nothing. All right. I want to make a red snapper. Oh, what'd you guys catch? Is that just a carp? So exciting. Is that the right size for CJ and his fishing challenge? I don't know what size a puffer fish is. I'm just gonna go talk to Diana, that's all I'm doing over here. And then I'm gonna do some fishing, I think. I guess I should just Google. Oh, she's moving in. She is fancy. She's maybe too fancy for my island. There you are, Jimmy. As you can see, my dear, I took... You're my dear, actually, Diana. I D-E-R. D-E-E-R. I took your advice and moved to this island. As you can see, I am totally unable to entertain anyone at the moment. It's quite embarrassing. Well, too bad, because you got me and Lewis here, so entertain us. <laughs> but I should have this cleaned up by tomorrow, so let's take some time to catch up soon. I can't sit on the boxes. No, nope, they're just boxes. All right. Well, let's go catch some puffer fish, I guess. Puffer fish size. I'm going to Google this real quick. Puffer fish size, Animal Crossing. It is... What size is it? Oh, it doesn't tell me the size on this little list I've got. Pufferfish shadow size is... Medium. Okay. So it's a medium. Catch three medium fish in a row. That's what I need to do. I gotta put some stuff into storage while I'm out doing this. I'll turn this into my storage place back here. Oh, I can't drop things. I can put it into storage though. Interesting. Oh, he caught a fish. Is that a, that's a goby, right? That's a freshwater goby, not a puffer fish. Is it, or is it a puffer fish? Don't mind me, I'm just in here putting some stuff in storage. And then I'm gonna go out and catch some fish. <laughs> Hello! There's not much in this back room. This is just my... It used to be... Oh, he's got a squid too. This used to be my little bath area. One plus one... Equals... Three? <laughs> Don't listen to my math skills. It's definitely not three. You guys like my sweet music? My sweet ska music? Oh, there's these little things here. If you want them, you can have those. He told me that one plus one does not equal three. <laughs> This looks medium-sized, right? 
Is that medium sized? It's an egg! Oh, it's not a fish. Come on. Lewis says two. My head is two. My angler sona. Let's see. Um, how's my progress? Looks like you haven't caught any big time fish yet. You might want to get on that. Don't catch any other sized fish or let one slip off your hook. That'll wipe out your streak. Oh man. One thousand plus nine thousand. Uh, one thousand plus nine thousand. Is this a trick question? Ten thousand. <laughs> What's with the math questions? You don't, you don't trust me that I know some math? No, I got it wrong. Ten thousand. Isn't that what I said? Didn't I say ten thousand? Maybe I didn't. Let's see, I'm looking for fish. That's what I'm looking for. Puffer-sized fish. Which is apparently a medium-sized fish. Is that one medium-sized? Kind of looks medium-sized-ish. Oh, it got off my hook. Oh, well, I didn't have a streak going anyways. Look at my fishing crew. That's a teeny fish. I don't want to catch that one. I need a medium sized fish. Come here, medium sized fish. Boy, there's no fish around. There's another tiny one. I don't want to catch that one. No fish there either. No fish. There's a fish. Is that medium sized? Oh, I got so nervous. I'm so bad at fishing. CJ is never going to give me his reward. There's another fish. Is that medium sized? Okay. Please be a medium sized fish. A squid? That's number one. Okay, good. So that is the right size. That's nice that it just tells me. That one's too small. reward is worth it. Oh, he's going to catch a fish. What is it? Go, 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 go. Oh, it's an egg. Oh, those eggs. That looks like the right size of fish. Oh, Lewis, you scared my fish away. If you run, you scare the fish. Don't run. Don't run next to me and scare my fish away. If you if you wouldn't mind. You can run around. But if you're going to follow me, then try not to run. You'll scare them all away. Boy, I feel like I'm in real life with my kids. That's what I tell my kids all the time. Don't run. Don't yell. You'll scare my fish. Okay, this should be two, right? Oh, it's another squid. Yes, this is number two for sure. Two big time fish. Go for three in a row. Ah, that's a big fish over there. Rain just caught a, a sea bass. It's rain time. Or it's rain time, right? Is that from Xenoblade Chronicles, I'm assuming? That was kind of a funny game for me. I really, really wanted to love it. And I just didn't. I think it was... 
It might have just been the wrong time of my life. I didn't have the right amount of time required to fully enjoy it, so I was trying to rush through it. And in the end, I just couldn't enjoy it. Oh, that looks like the right size of fish right there. Now don't mess up my streak. I don't get nervous. Okay, I did it. I think I did it. All right. No, it's an egg. Oh, come on. No. It messed up my streak. Oh, these eggs. Get these eggs out of here. How are you supposed to know if it's an egg or not? Oh, Lewis, you scared it away. It's because you're running. Don't run. You scare the fish away when you run. I'm so, I'm so irritated by that egg. That egg totally messed up my streak. Clams might be the way to do this, actually. I could just put some fish bait in until I get the right size of fish shadow, right? That's probably the smart way to do this. Come here, little fish. Ooh, a red snapper. Those are like my favorite ones from the ocean at the moment. What is that fish? Is that the turkey fish? The zebra turkey fish? The eggs! <laughs> These guys are showing off their awesome fish and I pull out an egg. Yeah, I should make some fish bait with my clam here. Oh wait, I can't put my... I can't put my workbench down. I have a workbench sitting over here somewhere. Where did it go? There it is. Let's craft some fish bait. fish bait in there. See what kind of shadow I get. That's a small one. Uh, you can have that one, Lewis. I don't really want that one. Oh, he said he's going to collect clams for me. Well, thanks, pal. That's another small fish there. What a chum, trying to help out the mission here, to finish whatever CJ's goal is. We're really, we're just making CJ famous if we do that. Maybe we shouldn't be helping him out. Make him do his own work, right? Oh, he doesn't have a shovel. Did this, did the eggs ruin my streak? I hope they didn't. That's number one. It did ruin my streak. Here, I'll drop. Uh, I'll drop a shovel. Can I drop it? There you go. There's a shovel for you if you really want it. It's just flimsy though, and it's already slightly used. It might be more than slightly used. It might be like heavily used. This looks like another medium fish. If this is an egg. Oh, these eggs! <laughs> no! I don't know if it's worth it to try this with these eggs all around here. And I broke my fishing pole. I don't know what you mean by that, Lewis. Do you mean something specific when you say that? Okay, I got enough to make another fishing rod. I 
have a crafting bench somewhere back over this way. I didn't want to move it, I wanted to use it. might not be worth my time to do this fishing challenge right now because these eggs are really messing everything up. like the right size fish if it'll look at it there we go ah, three eggs in a row come on these eggs are killing me That's a small fish. That's a medium fish. Oh, that must have been a rare one. It bit way too fast for my old man reflexes. <laughs> over there. Let's go get that one. Mm. It's not going to see it. hope it's not going to see that one. This is another one of those snooty fish that turns around. I really want to catch one of those turtles. Eggs! Seriously, how many eggs are there in my water places? Oh, there's Ryan again. I'm assuming it's pronounced Ryan. Oh, what was that? I just got rid of a fish? <laughs> Don't release them, sell them. Maybe? snapper a, a turtle I just caught a turtle look at him he's so amazing I want to keep him in my house but I got to give him to blathers oh and it counts for my streak you can't actually drop fish for people I've learned um, Ryan I had I was trying to give some to my buddy and you can't it, it doesn't seem like you can give fish so the turtles live in this part of the stream I know now yeah for whatever reason fish Fish seem to be off limits. You can give fossils, but I don't think you can give fish or bugs. Now I want to catch more turtles. Well, I appreciate the effort. You were trying to give me that red snapper. 
You can feel free to keep whatever fish you catch, though. <laughs> Partly because you have to. It won't let me take them from you. But also because if you catch them, then you earned them. CJ, your challenge is quite devious with this glut of Easter eggs that we have sitting around here. Okay, keep your eyes peeled for medium-sized fishes. That's a medium-sized fish, right? I'm so slow at the button on these. Oh, I caught my own red snapper. There we go, Ryan. Two big-time fish. Now, if I can only avoid the Easter egg. The Easter egg is the bane of my existence right now. Is that medium? That looks like... I don't think I want to... I think that's medium. Let's try it. Please don't be an Easter egg. Did I do it? Did I do it? I think I did it. That's three big time fish. All right, mission complete. Let's go see what CJ is going to do for us here. All right, Ryan and Lewis, if you want to see there, if you want to be there for my moment of triumph, meet me over at CJ. What what up, fishionista? Pick a name for your angler sona yet? No, I didn't. Well, backbeat. I guess backbeat. I caught three big-time fish in a row. That's right. Now that's going to make the chat explode. So much for my sea sports challenge. Wait a fish. Photo op. Oh, are you taking a selfie with me? No, he's taking a... F There's a selfie. He got a selfie with me. Perfect. Hey, you want to sell any of those fish? Because I want to buy. I've got bells for nautical miles, so chime on in. Well, don't just flaunt your money around like that, pal. I want to sell that... And that. And all of these, actually, except for my turtle. So will he only buy after you complete the challenge? You got a whole school for me. Altogether, that'll be 7,500 bells. Sure. Can you guys sell to CJ while you're here? Will he buy from you? I'm anchoring a special event soon, the fishing tourney. You ought to come. Gonna be super fun, even if you're still wet behind the ears. Plus, you might snag some swag, just saying. Okay. Yeah, if you can sell to him, totally do it. Lewis says, hey. Yeah, what is it, Lewis? Oh, CJ really likes this guy. You telling me to come over there? Oh, wrong way. Oh, there you are. Yeah? We taking a selfie or something? Is that what we're doing here? I'll take one. <laughs> I forget how to take the button. There we go. Oh, he drew all over my board. Lewis from Game Boy. He drew Sobble and Nani. Okay, well, thanks, thanks for drawing on my thing. Um, the fishing tourney is Saturday, April 11th. I didn't know that there were little announcements there. Cool. Is there some alert that tells you there's a new item, a new island announcement? Well, let me see here. It's nine o'clock. I should probably... I should probably go on to bed sometime. Well, not go to bed, but be done with this sometime soon. 
and take care of some, some real life stuff since I started a little bit earlier than normal tonight. Now where did CJ go? He was, there he is. Oh yeah, he'll just buy all my fish right now, now that I've completed his challenge. So now it's just pull fish out of the water and sell them to him, I guess. Oh, that was perfect, and then the fish swam right past it. And it turned around. These fish. They're so picky. And you turn around <laughs> come on, fish. Hold still. Hold still while I catch you. I hope you like these kind of fish, CJ, because I'm going to sell it to you. Hello, Pom Pom. Do you want to go fishing with us? We are having a fishing tourney tonight. I'll have to be back for the tourney this weekend. Oh, man. I'm so slow. I wonder what you get for the fishing tourney. The ones that bite so fast make me so jumpy that then I always miss the next fish. Well, I'm not making as much money selling to CJ as I envisioned that I would. Hey, that looks like a new fish. What is Oh, it's a surgeon fish. Scalpel, forceps, fish hook. That's a new one for sure. I'll have to give that one to Blathers. Oh, Ryan's back. Hey, Ryan. What's up, pal? Oh, that's a big fish right there. This is the kind that gets away from me. I can give that one to CJ. And Lewis is back. Oh, I missed. Oh, I cast that one. Oh, there's your zebra turkey fish. Can you sell it to CJ? Will he not buy from you? Oh, come on. Why am I so slow with the fish? I'm the world's worst fisherman. sort of run out of fish to catch. Hmm. 
Oops. Oh, I can look at their passports. Let's look at the passports. Festive son. Resident representative, he has peaches. And... Lewis has apples. Oh, did you miss that poor fish, Lewis? No, that's Ryan. Sorry, that's Ryan. fish right there? I thought I saw one. Did I not see one? I did see one. It's kind of hard to see that one down there. Oh, eggs. Eggs. All day long and nothing but eggs. Oh, no. <laughs> I am so... I'm going to make a sad face for that one. Oh, cold chill. Because I'm so bad at fishing. Hey, nice umbrella. That's a good umbrella. Huh? Well, that'll make a good thing to sell to CJ. Ryan is thinking again. What's he thinking about? I saw you caught oarfish. Oh yeah, I did catch the oarfish. It was super creepy, but I was I was really happy about it. Oh, that reminds me. I forgot to go. I was gonna go YouTube it for real and see what the real oarfish is like. the designs on this game are accurate enough that I assume that that's what it really looks like. And if so, good grief, it's an ugly fish. Let's see if this is even worth it. It might not be worth it to sell to him. Oh, do I have three of one fish? I'll keep these ones. I might be able to get a Crucian Carp model. That could be cool. 1,200 bells? I think that's quite a bit more than usual, right? Alright, let's see if I can get one more Crucian Carp. I never thought I would say that. I never thought I would be looking for one more Crucian Carp. Lewis, you're such a troll. You just scared my fish away. You, like, speared him to death. Hmm. All right, Lewis. I'm watching you. Crucian carp? Oh, it's a cherry salmon. That's a cool one. You need wood? What do you need some wood for? Oh, he can't get up. Hmm. 
Let's see, are you trying to build a ladder for, for Ryan? Is that what you're doing? Because that's what I was going to do. He just got a Crucian Carp. What is that creepy bug there? You see that weird bug? Oh, you got it. I've never seen that one. What is that bug? Is it a rare bug? to build a ladder? I don't. Oh, I need one more of each kind of wood. But I also need to build an axe first. <laughs> I don't even have enough to build an axe because I don't have stones. Why don't I just buy this stuff? was a gianter beetle. Let's see what else I can get. A ladder recipe? water beetle. Seems like it's probably not rare then, right? I assume that's not the only water beetle I'll ever see in my life. I've never noticed one before, though. Okay, well, I've got a ladder recipe for you, if you want it. You may already have one. I would like a model of a cherry salmon, actually. All right, well, here is a... No, don't learn it. I want to drop it. And a... A ladder. There you go. Now you can follow us up the cliff if you really want to. Alright, I caught that moth. I always scare those away. I just scared a bug away. Probably just a stinky bug, right? I was on a mission for a Crucian carp. I don't really need one, but I kind of want one to make a fish model.
Cherry's always back there creeping around her house. I don't know what she's up to. A freshwater goby. Time to go go bye-bye. Hey, we got one more viewer here. Thanks for joining us. I am about to be done, I think. Because I've already been going at this for about two hours, which is a pretty long time. It's about all the relaxation that I need for one afternoon. Alright. A dace. Thanks for stopping by, Ryan. Safe travels on your trip back to Russia. Hope you enjoyed your time here on the Tonight Show. Thanks for being a nice, a nice visitor. Hey, all right, I got my Crucian Carp. Let's go make my model. And I think with that one, I will probably call that an episode. Because that was the last thing that I really wanted to do. Oh, I should say bye. I guess I said bye in real life, but also on here. I want a collectible. Make me a collectible. That grammar's not very proper, because it sounds like he's going to turn me into one. Oh, please end the conversation. Oh, he takes my picture every time. You're kind of, you're kind of quick with that camera, CJ. Someone's leaving. All right, we'll see ya. I'll probably end the multiplayer session with that one. Ryan is going home, because um, I did want to drop off these fossils. I guess I'll just do that tomorrow, actually. I'll drop off my fossils and sell my, my bug tomorrow. Well, that was nice. Nice having some visitors come by. Thanks for stopping by. Even though you speared my fish, Lewish, I'll forgive you. <laughs> Yeah, so let's end this session here. So again, thanks thanks everybody for watching. Um, this is just going to end my multiplayer session. Hope you had fun. And we'll, I'll have to do this again sometime. And once I talk to CJ, I'll end the episode officially here officially. Actually, no, I, well, he's going to leave. He'll, yeah, he's going to leave before tomorrow, so I do have to talk to him. Don't run, there might be a moth on my tree. Seems like whenever I run, there is one, and when I don't run, there is no moth. Okay, CJ. You want to buy some last few fish for me? I want to sell a goby and a... Hmm. I, maybe I want to keep that. I think I want to keep that to make a model of it, actually. The cherry salmon. I like the cherry salmon. 960 bells? Yeah, it's... Yeah, fishing for money isn't worth it unless you're catching, like, great fish, I think. And those ones I had were not great fish. All right. Well, thanks again, everybody. Thanks, Ryan, for stopping by. Thanks, Lewis, for stopping by. And Jaden, and everybody else who dropped in and watched or is watching this after the fact. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this and you want me to do more, like, subscribe, leave a comment, ring the bell so you know when I go live, and let me know what you'd like me to do.
if you have questions, feel free to hit me up with those. And I will see you on the next time. So until then, don't forget to slip, slap, and slop. And I will say Miru Pafshim. <laughs>